Hi guys, this is um, QMU and I thought I'll, I'd test installing inside the virtual machine because we always say don't, right? Don't. Things change at the moment. It's not, well, the keyboard isn't okay and it's slow because I just want to record a conflict in packages when you update. So let's hope we get till there and then it may crash, right? So Wayland stuff is better always on real metal, certainly Wavefire, Sway and Hyperland. That's what we've been telling all along. Tried it in VirtualBox, uh, trying it now in QMU and um, although it's, it's small and it's slow and it's doing strange things, that's not, uh, that doesn't do on real metal. All I want to show you is a conflict if there is one this is the ISO of 0301 and as usual packages are updated, changed and dependencies adapted and so should we adapt I mean. So let's see if we get some kind of conflict and then show you what you can do to solve it. I'm afraid to change anything. I'm already happy I see something. <laughs> we could try to find the uh, change the display. But like I said, <laughs> let's wait for uh, hopefully a boot up something. But conflicts not yet. Let's be patient. There are two things. Hyperlint waybar is gone and replaced by waybar git and there's also hyperlang and hypercursor was there as well but first we have to see right Uh-huh, how about that? <laughs> Everything is just fine. How about that? Okay, S, R, enter. Keep your fingers crossed. Uh-huh. So waybar is dead. That's all kind of strange. And Ctrl T is doing something. I'm pressing some buttons. Things we can't ah, see. Okay. So keep typing. Sudo. And then back. Man. That's wrong. Let's move back in. Oh, yeah. That's so wrong. Okay, let's go to the beginning, beginning. Let's do another Control T, let's see. As long as we can see something. Nope, <laughs> the other one then. Nope. Aha. Mm, this is Kitty. Okay, how about Alacrity? No? Yeah, right. Ala Okay, Alacrity is pseudo. No, nope, it's not showing either. Pseudo, that's good. Pacman, also good. No. Nope. <laughs> okay, let's do an enter. Yeah, okay. That's my password. Try it. See if it can work. All right, let's try to give me give me that's not an M, that's an M. 
a z no a z t oh my god right how about control f3 control f3 f4 control f2 control f5 nothing helps me now oh, okay let's keep trying then this is a z yeah a z t no i can't do a backspace okay how nice ah there he is a z t and the dash hyperload yes give me hyperload and that is it reboot okay no not that one so sudo reboot enter you gotta have some patience for computers right no 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 wrong button so the problem is way bar ctrl alt t we got this beautiful thing f12 is any better no not better at all so let's type blind sudo pack man minus s way or git okay enter then it will say that it conflicts with hyperland waybar so that's gone doesn't exist anymore so yes you say and then you enter so waybar hyperland git is out and waybar git is in and you say yes no yes Enter. That's that. And then you log out. Super X. Log out. Then we log back in. So much fun, right? <laughs> then we got our waybar at least. Control T. Uh huh. Right? Waybar caused it. So if we update our system, that should be doing our Thing should be working some of them some of you have, have problem with sudo pacman minus s there is hyperlang that's new hyperlang i think so we have these versions and installed is oh, minus r no spell space between it minus r you see it's no no good working on a virtual machine right so this is what we have on the machine hyperlang git and hyperlang there's also hyperlang git so if there is a conflict you have to remove one with the other and there is also the hyper cursor that was updated that's now actually on there you go so that's now a dependency of and if i remember correctly it moved to the official official yes hyper cursor arch links repos voila it's coming from extra so we don't need to build it anymore so it's from away from our repos and that's how things happen um it first starts out on the AOR, Arch User Repository. Then it either gets picked up or not by the Arch Linux team as good enough to be on the Arch Linux repo. And then it moves and then we need to, we're still building, right? Because it's then available on the Arch repos. I hope it helped. It was a good test, but also a convincing test not to use Hyperland in 
virtual machines. This was QMU. VirtualBox didn't do anything. So there you go. <laughs> All right. Cheers.